How's it going guys? It's been a while, I know. I didn't mention back in 2023 saying that I would do more vlogs whatsoever, but I just I just didn't have enough motivation to do another vlog whatsoever. But anyways, it's 2024. This is the first vlog of 2024. I'm just too lazy to vlog. Even though I did mention that I will vlog more back in 2023, but I just decided not to. But anyways, 2024. Hopefully I'll do more vlogs later on this year. And um, this is um, this is the day before my birthday tomorrow. Well, tomorrow's my birthday, that is. I'm old, I'm turning 26, so life goes by fast and whatsoever. And my nephew and nieces, well, they're growing up pretty fast from what I see. And yeah, so anyways, this is pretty much the first vlog of 2024. So what I'm gonna do today is, today I'm gonna vlog as much as possible. So that's pretty much the main idea today, or well, the main objective. You should say it's it's kind of windy right now, so I don't know if like my phone can pick up my voice or my audio. So hopefully you guys can hear me pretty well. A lot of like you should say like somewhat. You know what? I don't even know how to explain it. A lot has happened. There you go. So yeah, just a lot has happened and whatsoever. But anyways, um. Yeah, it's been a while since I do vlogging, so I don't know what much, what much to say or how to make a video anymore. Hopefully, today goes well, so it's pretty nice out. It's not too hot whatsoever, not too cold. It's pretty good for like a weathering vlog. So, yeah, like I mentioned, I'll just try to like vlog as much as possible as today vlog as much as possible for today that is not as today for today but anyways um updates on the type bar here's the type bar as you can see I went lowered I went lowered so right now I'm running TNS tech loading springs because I think that's pretty much the best choice I have I could have went with Swift or RSRs but I just chose TN because why not, you know? And not only that, like, I somewhat daily this car, well, more like a daily it. So I want it to be, like, dailyable. I, I don't, I'm not sure if that's even a word. So, yeah. That's the only thing that's updated. So, whatsoever. I still got more plans for this car coming soon later on this year. But, yeah, so we'll see what happens. Most likely gonna get an exhaust or an intake, one or the other. But yeah, that's pretty much what's been updated on the Type R. Just slowing springs, even though it's still stock. So, eh, I mean, it looks better right now. It looks better than stock height earlier, later on. Or not later on, but earlier this year, whatsoever, and back in 2023. So yeah. It looks a lot better now. It looks lower. It looks a lot nicer. It looks more like a race car now. Also, back in 2023, you remember my uh, my buddy Andy? He had a legacy, but now that car is like overheated and spread spread all over his engine bay. And yeah, so he has to sell it and get a new car. At first we were gonna swap it, but we couldn't purchase the motor. So that's what we did. But we turned out to be a fail. So he just bought a new car. Then he modded it. So it looks nice. Yeah. Uh, we'll see if he comes. Because there's much to do. Might as well do something, you know. But yep. We'll see if he comes. Eleven minutes later. Here it is. Andy's new car. So Acura TSX. And as you guys can see, he had a Mugen kit on it, which is pretty nice. You don't really see these nowadays. Yep. 
Here's a gritty muffler exhaust and some Motegi wheels. And obviously in Japan it's a Honda Accord. But there's a TSX, it's a US. Yeah, there's a American badge, the Honda emblems. And yeah, it's pretty clean. Very clean. As you guys can see. Hi right, Andy, want to introduce us to your new ride? Well, here is my uh, 2007 TSX or the other side country, you might say the Honda Accord Euro R uh, CL9. So over what this two car is uh, just like a Reason say, uh, maybe for the maybe for the uh, and the bikes are maybe. Nice car are uh, from uh, WX because budget wise, I said. And with, and uh, the rim I have right now is uh, Motogi Racing Mint. What are you racing uh, MR 116, 116th? But maybe in the future, I plan to buy a new, newer ones. So you're paying on. If I ever want to go, if I ever want to buy new ones, maybe uh, RPI ones by uh, you guys or uh, T37s. This is a 50 50 chance, but I'm going to say 50 Still don't uh, have a call yet. So, yeah, and not much uh, engine wise. The only, the only thing I put in there is just a uh, uh, short rear intake by uh, weapon on. But in, but in over in the future, plan plan do a bit more. Might do a uh, full bolt on future or a uh, turbo in future. I haven't decided yet. But just to stay, stay tuned with Razor here. Maybe, maybe, maybe you, might, you might see me uh, with football on, on my TSX or Trouble. You know, maybe not know. And plus, I might, you know, we'll probably go to drop a little bit. My Clover's to drop it. Uh, the three brand I really want to go as a. Uh, Meg Racing Pullovers, Yonaka uh, Racing Pullovers, or uh, Godspeed Pullovers. But, right, but I don't need to worry about those things uh, right now because of my, uh, the shocks are still like, uh, perf perf perfectly uh, good. It's still not, like, it's not out yet, so I'll wait until the shocks are out. I'll, uh, Looking to buying pull-ups into it, but no, it's fine.